In this video, we will uh, discuss uh, how to change the path to MATLAB file when it is created with the Cameo Systems Modeler. And uh, here we see the blocker, uh, which uh, has the parametric diagram and uh, it has some properties. And then uh, there is uh, a constraint which calls the MATLAB. As we can see here, language is MATLAB. So it calls the MATLAB. And uh, there is a uh, preferred uh, location of the MATLAB file, which is, um, uh, first of all, in the Cameo project. So you can really embed that. Here you go, like this. Take it, drag it, wait three seconds, release, and then choose Create Attached File. You need to drag from uh, the right mouse button and then choose Attach File. And then this file will be used to to execute. So here we, we run it. And MATLAB will f search for this file here directly. So here we get that, right? So average temperature in 23. We change here, we get the temperature updated, right? Uh, yeah, so this, this uh, it's not average temperature, it's uh, something else, right? So, so it's uh, temp difference, right? Okay, so um, uh, now another way to use this file is to keep it in same package as the magic draw project so this is uh, uh, also second path which matlab will look for and uh, you see it works even there is no project the first way is preferred when you use cameo uh, teamwork cloud uh, and then you you kind of uh, that the project and together it goes with the matlab file so it's distributed together the second approach is actually maybe not very comfortable because you need not to forget to have this file here. But what if you don't have this file here? So what will happen in that case? For example, what if your file is somewhere else? So in that case, if we will run the simulation here, you see? Delete it. Run. It still memorizes this file location, this file, right? It is, uh, still takes it uh, from the memory. But um, uh, but if I will uh, uh, kind of uh, restart machine, you know, it will not know where is that file, and then it will not execute. So uh, uh, now the the choice here is to add the path uh, variable inside of MATLAB. And there is even tool which you can access here directly from command line. You choose this MATLAB here and they type path tool. So you get the path tool and here you can add the path to your uh, file. So then in that case, I will choose add folder, go to D here, see, and here is my, my MATLAB file save close and this this is the matlab path uh, variable dialog and if i will run it executes correctly why it is useful to search from here because you might have multiple versions of matlab installed that's what's happening for me and then uh, you can check uh, the version command which version you are using like for example this old one instead the new one which is uh, like uh, also available and also installed, and I have an A and B 20 version, and uh, actually 19, 2019, but uh, none of them were used, none of them were integrated here, and through integrations, and that as a result, you know, even if you add path variable to those new versions, there's still MATLAB, don't find that uh, M file. So that's the, that was the problem. Another way to solve this problem with the Path you actually can add it dynamically, right? So here is another project which reads dynamically the path, updates the path variables dynamically. So here we see add path. This is the command add path and then locate path to the MATLAB file. And it can be part of the constraint here. So here we see the constraint is really uh, executes whatever is here in, and MATLAB is the execution engine. So we can run this one and see that it's solved. And even the path was added. So for example, go here, path tool. Oh, that 
we need not to forget to change path to here we see this one remove this one save it close it then rerun this model and now path two and here you go this path is added so you can even include into the model so that's pretty much solves this problem which previously uh, required us to con maintain file matlab file together with the cameo project now you can maintain anywhere else